Chef FX. What's up, YouTube? We are back! Back with another video, baby! Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. We're back with another easy peasy simple recipe. Guys, are you familiar with TikTok? Man, I seen them making these fried Oreos on TikTok. So today we're gonna show you how to make fried Oreos two ways. What? Not one, but two ways. We're gonna show you how to make fried Oreos just like the carnival in an air fryer. And we're gonna show you how to make it on the stove. So y'all ready? I'm ready. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Because it's about to go down. Damn. Guys, what you're gonna need is some Oreos. We got, oh, we got the Pokemon Oreos. See that, the special edition? The ones with the Mew? Guys, we got about two Mews in here. I ain't gonna lie, we got two Mews in here. Y'all want them, let us know. So first, what you're gonna do is you're gonna put your Oreos in the freezer. Wait a second, what, what would you have done if I said I ate a Mew? You're still standing, right? <laughs> Anyway, so guys, like I, like, I, like I was saying, you're gonna put your Oreos in the freezer. Put them in the freezer for about an hour or two. You want your Oreos nice and frozen. So we got your Oreos. Guys, you're gonna need some pancake mix. We ain't got the Aunt Jemima, sorry. It's not even called Aunt Jemima now. It's called Pearl Millen Company. I don't know why. I don't know why they changed the name from Aunt Jemima to Pearl Millen Company. So we ain't buying it. They gotta put the name back to Aunt Jemima, then we gonna buy it. So we bought the uh, generic. <laughs> we bought the generic pancake mix. So you're gonna need some pancake mix. You're gonna need some powdered sugar because you gotta coat that Oreo all up with the sugar, give it the sweet goodness. Guys, for your air fryer, you're gonna need some non-stick spray. And if you're making it on the stove, you're gonna need some oil. That's all you need, guys. So whatever way you're making it, comment below. Let us know how you're making it. You're gonna use the air fryer, or you're gonna use the stove. So let's get into this video. Chef and Chef Bats, you guys ever cooking with your husband and he never knows where anything is? That's me, that's my life. Chef Trini never knows where anything is. That's crazy. So, we're what? not gonna cook with this generic one because what? we have Angel Mama right here. No, but, but, right here. But, but not, right here. But you're not called Angel Mama no more. Well, Pearl Milling Company, no, okay? No, no, no. It's still Angel Mama. Oh. Just the name changed to the same box, okay? This is what we're using, the brand, not the generic. Guys, hashtag Aunt Jemima in the comments. Listen, Chef Trini, you gotta look. You Hasht to look. Hashtag Aunt Jemima in the comments. Ugh. We need the name back. We do need the name back. Next, they're gonna change Uncle Ben. Oh, no. Yeah, you know I mean? Don't do that. Okay, telling you. All right, so we poured about a cup and a half, about two cups, of, um, look, I spilled it all over me. Um, and Jemima, no, right, pearl milling, pearl milling, pearl milling, in our cup. We have some, this one is just, it's complete. You just add water to this one. They also have the one that's not complete. You have to add eggs and milk and all that jazz. We're just gonna add water to ours. And we're gonna make it not too thick, not too liquidy. Okay, so I'm gonna pour a little bit at a time. This is a cup of water. But as you see, I'm just gonna do a little bit at a time. If I need more flour, I mean powder, I'll do that. But we want it at thick enough where you're gonna be able to dip the Oreo in there and it's not going to crumble and break up, you know? And you don't want it too runny because then guess what? You're not getting no coat on your Oreo. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix this up real nice. We're gonna heat up this air fryer so it can get nice and warm. And we're gonna dip these Oreos in there and then I'm gonna show you. Look at this, hold on, hold on, hold on. Before I even do you guys. You see this? We see it. Too we, thick, we, let's we, add a little bit more water. I'm coming in. Show, show us the consistency. You I'm gonna see. show you right now. I showed you before, I don't know if my, my thumb was in the way, but before that, what, what you just saw was too thick. Oh, oh, I got a tip, guys, guys. If you like stuff sweet, put a little sugar in there. Or if you sweet like me, just dip your finger. Oh, God. <laughs> just so, Trini, I'm, not, I'm not sweet. You're sour. I, ooh, oh, God. I'm sour. Now look at this. This is what the consistency you want, okay? All right. 
All right, so next I'm gonna show you what to do with all this. All right, chefs and chefettes. So Chef Sam already made our batter. We're gonna show you how to make these fried Oreos in the air fryer first. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna coat your air fryer lightly with a little bit of non-stick non spray, not too much. You're gonna take your frozen Oreo, dip it in the batter, right? And place it in your air fryer. Let's go. That's it? That's, that's it. That's it. That's it. Make sure you cover it really good. Let me see what you're doing. Place it in the air fryer. I don't even need this fork. This fork all in my seam. Just, just, oh, oh, excuse just me. Just my sh up. That's it. Cover everything nicely. Guys, everyone's air fryer is different. So... You gotta play with you gotta play with the settings. So we're gonna put ours in our air fryer for about on 350 to 360 for about three to five minutes. So 360, let's let's do. But check it, check it. So we're gonna start with three minutes. We're gonna check it, make sure it's done, and I'm gonna see you when we get back. All right, chefs and chefettes, guys, our carnival style fried Oreos in the air fryer is done. Don't click off yet because. This is the air fryer recipe. We're gonna show you how to do it on the stove. So in our air fryer, I was cooked on 360 degrees for six minutes. Boom, it's perfect. I'm gonna take it out right now. I can tell you coming. <laughs> you want a peek? Come, 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 come. Take a, a peek. Take a peek, take a peek, take a peek. All right, all right. Wow. Guys, it's hot, it's hot. It's hot. Ooh, 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 Scotty, ooh. Holy crap. Guys, y'all see that? Wow, that looks good. Now all you do, take your powdered sugar and have fun. And have fun. Have fun. The kids like it sweet, so we're gonna load these bad load boys up that. with powdered sugar. Load it up. How much sugar? If you have diabetes, don't do this. <laughs> but if you're good, and if it's for the kids, yo, load it up, have fun. Look at that. I'm gonna come in, I'm gonna show you guys. I think that's enough sugar, okay, okay. Ooh, ooh, Please come in, ooh. let's see, let's see. My, my, my sugar going off just looking at this. Guys, look at this. Wow. Carnival style that Oreos definitely... in the air fryer. Wow. 360, six minutes in our air fryers. Yours may vary. You gotta play with it, you gotta check it. Guys, make Look this, and now we're gonna show you how to do it on a stove if you haven't got an air fryer yet. So let's go. All right, it's time for the classic style fried Oreos carnival way. So, paying attention? We're paying attention. We showed you the air fryer way. Now we're gonna fry it in oil, in oil. So we're gonna take our Oreo, frozen Oreo, same like before, same mixture. What is it, Pilling Miller? What does it change now? Aunt Jemima. Aunt Jemima. All right, look at this. Have our Oreo. Dip it. Ooh, I hear it. You hear that? I got a little hole right there. Let's just Yeah, so I, what I do is I usually hold it from the sides, Chef Sam. All right. So you don't remove the um, coating. I knew I had you here for something. Yes. I know, I good for something. <laughs> I good for something. Chef Trini, look you right. Look. Oh. Yeah, yes, yes. I use the whole. Look at that. Yeah, ooh, 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 that's so smart. You're so smart. And, right. and you just say I do Tish. I say that all the time. All the time. This is things you be doing. Like not looking properly for the right pancake but you want to use generic brand. No. I said I was protesting Aunt Jemima. No, no, no. Until they changed the name back. Chef and Chef X. You don't listen. You're going to see what he said. They know. I said I was protesting it. And then you come out and pull out pearl milling from the cabinet after I said I protesting. You don't look. I said you I said we don't have. I didn't say that. We don't have. Quote me. Cook the damn food. But wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Hold wait, first of all, you're not gonna speed past that like you didn't just say what you just said. Look at this. So we're gonna cook this for like Two minutes on each side because it's oil, so it's gonna cook faster. Oh yeah. And you're gonna flip it real gently. And you can see if once I move out the way, you're gonna see that the other side is already getting golden. Alright. 
Can you see this? We can see it. Let me let me zoom in. Look at that. That looks amazing. Can I get in your way now? Can I turn it? Can I flip it? All right. So we don't want it to burn. This is the first one I did over here. Let's take a peek to see what it's looking like. Okay. It's been about two minutes. Look at that. And they're floating up. Look at Ooh, this. Ooh, it's cooking really good. Look at this. Look all at that. All right, all right, all right, all right. Two more minutes. We just put it for like two minutes, guys. Do that on each side, and then you take it out, and you put it on the plate so all the oil you could absorb. And I'm going to show you what to do. Carnival Oreos are done. I cooked them on in the frying pan with oil, two minutes on each side. That was it. And look how amazing they look. Nice and golden. Oh, we're coming in. We're coming in. It looks so good. It smells great. It smells like a carnival up in here. It sure does. Um, so all we have is some powdered sugar. We're going to load it up because who doesn't love powdered sugar? Our kids love powdered sugar. So true. I currently love powdered sugar. So look at this. We're just going to pour this whole watch me put the whole thing just because oh god, oh my god. I, i'm getting diabetes watching this <laughs> <laughs> guys if you can't have sugar yeah. like chef trini said don't put sugar mm. it's already sweet as it is so true. Fuck this shit. oh god oh god oh god oh god somebody call 911 what the ah. oh god. that's it that's it you see how that looks yeah banging all that sugar all right. let me just pick this up real quick not too close to Chef Trini because we're eating. That's it. That's all you need to do to make this amazing dish, guys. All right. It's done. Guys, our air fried, regular fried, carnival style Oreos are done. Let me show you the air fried Oreos first. It looks amazing. Yeah, I see that. And it's so quick. You guys have to make this video. Oh, yeah. Show them yours. I mean, have to make these Oreos. I Ooh, said video. guys, make these Oreos. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Mm. Heck yeah. That's it, guys. Look at it. It looks the same. Whatever you prefer. Comment below which way you're going to make it. Like Chef Trini said, guys make these Oreos. Let us know which one you, you make, like he said. Yo, this is busting. It is so good. I'm so glad I put that extra sugar on there. This is so good. Yo, yes. Let us know. Air fryer or on the stove. That's it. Best of both worlds, two recipes in one. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And we, we are out.